hello guys in this video i will show you how to create setup file with database and deploy the da deploy the setup file with data my microsoft sql server database in c sharp on this one application database creation connection with f in link you all are described in this video now I'm going to show you how to attach existing database MDA file to deploy a setup file with database in C-Sharp Windows application. See in the uh, below side of this screen, uh, right below side, now here is, uh, I am just showing how to uh, connect and everything in this uh, uh, tutorial of li uh, link you C-Sharp. This is the PBS connection, my database connection uh, uh, in FFE config file. Now I'm gonna attach uh, the MDF file from the directory C program for Microsoft SQL Server dot SQL Express data. So my first TV MDF file. Log MDF and LDF both file. You must uh, copy the both file and paste it in uh, the. Oh sorry, uh, file is already open in the application. First of all, we need to close the file, delete the connection, or close the application and reopen. I'm just deleting it. If you have uh, delete the connection, then you can paste it uh, again. Try continue. Okay, continue. See that the MDF file and LDF file uh, paste in here. Now I'm gonna attach it uh, uh, from the desktop where I've saved already. Right click, add existing item. Uh, my items MDF and LDF file uh, exist in the uh, desktop. Select all file. Files are uh, displaying here. Select both file, MDF and LDF file. My first DB MDF and my first DB LDF. Just click on Add. Okay, the MDF file, uh, uh, the both file already added. This wait. It's my existing information uh, of this database table and view. I ha I have only table and view. That's why if you have a stored structure function, you uh, you must select here. See that now the new connection already created in the app, app config file. My first DBMDF integrated security equal to two. This is my new connection. Uh, the above one is uh, my previous connection. Now uh, go to the solution explorer, right click and add new project uh, to create a setup file. Add new project. Uh, the, uh, I'm going to create a setup file here. Visual Studio Installer. Select Setup Project. This is the location. GBG Capture. My F files. My F uh, F saved. I just uh, um, uh, create a setup file there. Now build. Okay. Uh, now click on the application folder. Right click on the application folder. Add project output. Primary output. Okay. The primary output added. Now uh, we have to add uh, the MDF and LDF file here. Build it uh, again. It's building. Just wait. Building is done. Okay. Now I'm gonna add uh, MDF and LDF file here uh, so that uh, uh, when I set up, when I install this application, the MDF and LDF file also added in there. Uh, System file, system drive. Okay, the MDF and LDF file already added. Create shortcut. Uh, shortcut file uh, add in the user desktop after installing the shortcut file will display in the desktop. Build and rebuild again. Now our setup file over already created. Okay, open folder folder and store where, where I uh, created the setup file. This is the setup file. Just uh, open the debug folder. Okay, uh, see that uh, my setup file already created. Now I'm gonna install it in my computer. Okay, I'm just installing it. I will show you after installing the MDF and LDF file will save in the uh, system drive. And when I insert data or retrieve data, the data will modify, will update in the system drive's MDF and LDF file. Okay, now I'm gonna insert uh, one record. Record is uh, see that shortcut. The shortcut is uh, after installing the uh, application software, uh, the 
this is the C program file where my uh, file is already uh, set up. My first TV MDF and LDF file also uh, include here. Okay, now I'm gonna uh, input a record. Uh, ID is 5 Hanga name and address is my city. is 34 select on image just uh, I just choosing an image okay now just insert record is added this record this record added in this folder uh, in the uh, system drive uh, my fast TV MDF and LDF if you want if you install it in another uh, another PC uh, what are they doing the data will added in there if you want to restore the uh, restore the uh, database just copy the MDF file and paste the uh, system drive location see that there is no new record why because the record is updated in the uh, system drive C drive program files uh, at default component set of one this location the data added in this uh, my first MDF file.